good morning ladies and gentlemen actually it's not even morning right now it is about 307 p.m today has been an interesting day because tomorrow is opener of teal season here in the fantastic state of are we in iowa we are in iowa and it is opener teal starting tomorrow but i got some really important news really really important news that i've been saving for months and months and months and months as you guys know this this guy right here the squeaker seeker now has a duck blind. I just got this blind right here installed. It is ready to rock and roll. The best part is you have a chance to win this boat. Yes, you heard it right. I'm giving away this boat at the end of the season. I'm going to be using it all season. And then one of you lucky viewers has the opportunity to win. Boom, right here, this shirt. This is how you get entered to win. So what we're doing is uh, we're doing a duck hunting, not even duck hunting, just hunting t-shirt of the month basically around waterfowl, you know, ducks, geese, snow geese, stuff like that. And uh, if you're a duck hunter, you're a goose hunter, you're gonna wanna sign up for this. So what you do is you'll click the link at the very top of the description of this video. You sign up, all right, you get a shirt every single month and for every month that you are signed up, you get entered one time. So if you sign up from now until the end of the contest, let's say that's six months from now, you get entered a total of six times to win this boat. And you're getting everything. You're getting the boat, you're getting the trailer, you're getting the motor, you're getting the blind, you're getting literally everything that we have right here. And all you do, gotta do is sign up. This shirt is September's shirt. So if you guys wanna sign up right now, between now and the end of September, this is the shirt you're gonna get. Fast food, cause you guys get it to blue teal and it's like the blue rocket, the whole thing. If you're a duck hunter, you understand what I'm saying. So go click down, but click the link down below, go sign up. Again, you get a chance to enter with this and we will take the winner on a duck or goose hunt of their choice. So you win a free hunting trip and the boat by clicking the link down below. Sign up, that's pretty much my spiel. What we're doing is we're testing this blind out today. We're gonna go put it on a marsh, a very sketchy marsh. And you guys are gonna see exactly why this Mud Buddy and Excel boat is the best duck hunting what you can get because we're talking about being in like this much water, getting to the juice for teal hunting. You guys stay tuned. Ladies and gentlemen, we found an open pocket of water in the midst of all these. Look at that. It's like pads for absolute days. Pads for freaking days right over here. And then an open pocket for teal. This is exactly what we were looking for was we basically powered through all these weeds or the, the, the lily pads having no idea whether or not there's going to be any water. And it turns out there is water. There's actually quite a bit of water, plenty for, for some teal to land. So the question is we haven't seen any birds. We're not seeing anything right now. So the other thing I didn't tell you guys was Austin, you know, my buddy Austin, my buddy Brad, you know, part of the Ducks crew, we, they're scouting way up north, like three hours north of us, and we came south, and we're thinking the birds have not quite migrated all the way south yet. So I don't know if we're actually gonna hunt this spot, but you know, you never know until you scout it. So far, no birds. Look at that. That's what it looks like with the blind on. And look at that, looks like a freaking bush. That literally looks like a bush. Look at Bobby's over here with the motor. So obviously you would cover up the motor, but I wanted to show you guys what it looks like. Look at this, this is the inside of it with the blind. You could, we're gonna put four seats in here and then you got all the front deck, you got all the storage under this. And it's got a mud motor, you guys can see it's a wacky looking motor that can get through basically anything as you guys saw earlier. But this is what it looks like, it looks good. We literally just installed this, we haven't really, you know, finessed with it as far as you know making sure it's all straight and whatnot but it does not look like a boat like you could totally beach it up against any basically any reeds any marsh and be completely concealed so anyways i just wanted to show you guys we're kind of just scouting just looking around again finding some more spots but no birds zero birds right now so we're not sure if we're gonna hunt this we're gonna give austin a call here in a little bit and see what he's found up north because he's been he's been in completely opposite like three hours away from us basically he spent all morning so we're gonna give him a call here in a bit but we gotta have some more fun and rip this boat around some more. Hello? Yo, what's up? Just got back from scouting. Did you guys see anything? Yeah, we found, we found a couple of good spots. The third spot had a bunch of teal, a bunch of wood ducks. Really? You actually so you actually saw birds? Yeah. We didn't get it. I mean, we had it. We found a really cool spot, but we didn't see any birds at all. So I don't think I think south is a bust. I think we need to go north. All right. Well, we're gonna head back, and then we'll just meet. We'll just meet at my house. All right. Bye. Bye. Well, 
good news, ladies and gentlemen. We suck at scouting, apparently, or we just picked the wrong location. Uh, like I said, the, the spot we found was really juicy. It was very isolated water pockets, which is perfect because then you're not competing with other places, and it's really hard to get into. Obviously, if you don't have a boat like mine, you're not getting in there. But the issue, we didn't see any birds, and as you heard, Austin actually found a spot with wood ducks, which obviously is irrelevant other than the fact that there's ducks there because we can't shoot those. And then teal. Um, so since we scouted four or five spots total and only saw one spot with ducks, that is where we are headed in the morning. But right now we got to drive back and actually we're gonna make a quick stop at the grocery store. We got to get food to cook for breakfast tomorrow. That's my favorite part of duck hunting. Made it to the wall of Mark with the entire squad. Squad, squad, Bert, dirty. The dirty bee has arrived. He He's here. The dirty bee. And look at that shirt. Mm. Oh yeah, mine's actually clean. Yeah, mine's pretty dirty. Yeah, you're looking. I'm looking. You're too, looking. Look at the fit, honestly, oh. boys. Look at the fit. Look how on point this is. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we finally made it to the spot. We uh, we launched the boats really, really early. We woke up at 3 a.m., got here, and uh, basically cleared an entire spot, used the mud buddy, and just turned it all up. We got Austin's boat over there, this boat here. Remember, if you guys want to win this boat, click the link at the top of the description. Check it out. Sign up. Look at it. There's plenty of room. we got four guys in here, and uh, it's very, very comfortable. This is the first time we've ever hunted out of this boat in particular. I'm pretty excited. It's been probably nine, nine-ish months since we shot teal, so we've been itching for this moment today. We do have some, some thunderstorms rolling in though, so it could get interesting. I'm pretty excited though. What do you guys think? You ready? Oh yeah. Go time. Stay tuned. <laughs> What are you doing, Rick? Wait, what is what is that swimming? They're green. Well, that's a muskrat. What do you what's what's the plan? What are you doing? Give them an update. Tell them exactly what's happening and what Obviously you're about to do. Obviously, the sun's up. We've been sitting here. What's it been about 25 minutes since shooting light? Yeah. And we've we've watched probably a good thousand to fifteen hundred teal pile in about 300 yards north of us. So you know how it is contending with a live feed. Me and Bradley are gonna go over there, spook them up. If you hear some gunshots. Hope for the best. So the plan is hopefully they they shoot some and scare up the rest, where then they come and bounce to us, and then me and Austin, and, well, I guess you're not even shooting, and then Austin's dad. So it's us three. It's the three amigos. Shooting behind the glass, though. And the old oh, big shooter. Yeah. That's the plan right now. We're seeing lots of birds, so it gets us excited, but not killing a whole lot. Just been, been skirted so far. All right, well, we're almost there. I'm going to roll the camera for a minute. Should be a lot of birds over here. They're way over there. You see them? We're over there in that open pocket. Yeah, there's a bunch of teal back here, boys. Oh, look, they're gonna skim over us. Yep. That boy dead. Oh, look what we found. First duck of the season right there, baby. Oh man, I've been searching forever to find you guy. Goodness. Well, things just got a wee bit interesting. Like I said, Bobby was going to go over there with Brad and try to spook up the feed, and they did, and they actually shot some, as you guys saw in the video. That, that GoPro footage was Bobby's, Bobby's shooting, and uh, they actually scared some over here to where we almost got shots off, but we're just convinced that that's the feed. So we're actually moving these boats. We're taking both boats over down there and hopefully going to get on the juice. I'm ready to kill some birds. <laughs> A few moments later. Take him. 
Nice shot. Woo! Nice Good shot. Time. Got him, boys. First one for me. That's my first heal of the season. Oh, nice. that, feel, that feels nice. good. Nice Ooh, that feels good. Yes. Nice shot, boys. Thank you, boys. Look at this little beauty right here. This is my first teal of 2018. Super excited. Blue wing, fast food. This is fast food, guys, right here. I absolutely love it. So right now, Bobby is communicating with a goose that landed right in front of us. He's actually using the new duck's goose call. So far, I think it works. We'll shoot him on the right. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Dump him. Good work, those. boys. Hey, yeah. let's go. Nice. Yes. Those were some tough shots, dude. They got up and dude, out Roskiv of there. Dude, is sitting there. The still. goose is still here. Look, the goose yeah. is still here. Well, what'd you think? Good oh, hunt? Fun. Yeah, it was fun. I had a lot of fun. It was, this is your first teal hunt of the year, right? I mean, it was mine too. Because well, yeah. Kansas opens later. Way later. Well, no, so that's why you're up here. Later, so yeah. it's the eighth. But I the think? birds won't be to Kansas like they are here. Yeah, true. Only shot nine, but we probably won't do that next week in Kansas. Well, we are now finally home. This is actually my base, and I haven't even really shown you guys this, but. It's just an absolute freaking mess. I gotta figure out what to do with my life. Look at all those boxes. Yep, just hunting and fishing stuff. We got our waiters hanging up drying. Bobby's made a makeshift desk. He's down here editing, doing big things with his life. And we are done hunting for the day. We are hoping to get out tomorrow. We're not sure because there's some rain. A bunch. Hurricane Katrina number two is headed towards Nebraska. And so we're gonna do our best to hunt. But as you guys know, cameras and water don't quite mix that all that well. So we'll see what happens. Hopefully this is not the only teal, early teal season hunt you guys see this year. But it quite possibly could be. We'll just kind of have to see you guys. We'll have to stay tuned and find out. I'm going to end the video here. Remember, if you guys want to win the boat, you saw how crazy that boat was. You saw how crazy it was. I mean, we went through inches of water, ripping through lily pads, ripping through the marsh, sitting in it, putting the blind up, shooting birds. It was an absolute blast shooting that thing. If you guys want to win, remember, click the link at the very top of the description. Sign up for every month that you're signed up you get entered so if you sign up for six months you get entered six times to enter to win to this boat right here that's Ooh. that's september shirt look how that's sick because we were shooting we were shooting the this, blue wings today this describes today literally today was it, fast food it was hard it was awesome like i said we're gonna be new shirts every single month you sign up you get a fresh tea fresh duck hunting goose hunting just waterfowl tea in general and uh, the, the sh these shirts, by the way, are only available when you sign up. You can't purchase these outside of the subscription. So they're limited edition. They're going to be sweet. You guys want to check them out. Plus, you get a chance to win a free hunting trip with us or fishing trip if you want and the boat. It's, it's a pretty good deal for just, you know, getting some, getting some pretty sweet t-shirts. Anyways, I'm going to end the video here. If you guys enjoyed, let me know. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Drop a comment down below. Peace!